Welcome one. to the electric zone. <laughs> Get one more. One more to for one. today. There's an enemy to your right. There's two. Oh, he's dead now. Oh, this is neat. It's a neat little insanely unsafe puzzle that the lights turn off whenever you go near them. Oh, no, God. Wow, ow. Just all the pain. Thanks. Wow! God damn you. Oh, good. I all died. Oh, so, funny story from my coworker today. All right, so I wasn't here when any of this happened, but, okay, to give context, she's, she's 16 and the guy's 21. Like where I'm going with this so far? No. <laughs> so, she, so this male co coworker, we'll call him S and we'll call her a C. S was talking to our, of uh, like. Sack and count. <laughs> sack and count her out for a diz eight. Nope. Um, so S was talking to like one of our other coworkers and C kind of, because like our other male coworker and C were like on the like on the same two caches. So um he started uh so okay fuck let me start this again cuz I fucked up the yeah. timeline. <laughs> okay. So C and S were talking before uh they were at the cache and S apparently told C that if she ever has kids that he can take care of her. Mind you, these two have never talked before today because S is very, very new and he's a cart guy and she works on the cache. So, you know, they don't really have a lot of interaction because he's, you know, outside most of the time. So there's apparently, you know, just a break in the day. You know, there's not really not a lot going on. So, S and our male co-worker are just, you know, hanging out and talking in French, which C can't understand. So our male co-worker told C later that S had said that she was cute and then went on to say that she was really hot and sexy, but told our male co-worker not to tell her. So, you know, like our male coworker's obviously a little worried about it and whatnot, so he tells her just like to let her know and shit. So that happens. And then apparently S got off work at like five. C got off work at six fifteen. S stayed just to chat with C, you know, till her shift finished. And I'm just like, mm, that's not a good sign. <laughs> Because that's a slightly stalkerish, just a little bit. So, yeah, that happened. And she was telling me about this today. I'm like, man, okay. Could be if, worse. If he, could be Torvar's brother. If he doesn't stop, though, um, you gotta, like, fucking tell management and shit and whatnot. And she, like, what the stupid part was, though, is, like, she wasn't really taking it all that seriously. And I'm like, man, this isn't a fucking, like, high school game shit is. Like, you're at work and this isn't okay. If he, like, if he does it again, tell the manager. Then you need to stand up for yourself and, you know, say, man, I'm not into this. I'm not into you. I'm not comfortable with this at all. Please, you know, stop with the flirting and whatnot. And she just wasn't taking it seriously. I'm like, man, okay. Like, what the fuck are you doing, man? Like, you gotta... God damn it. Fuck. Children are stupid. Yeah, well, this game is fucking stupid. I know. If I learn anything, it's that the DLC is even worse than the main game. That's the way forward. If I'm making this up, why is it so complicated? Because you're a complicated man, and no one understands you. But I'm talking... Very I'm confused. Why is he your brother-in-law if 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 he has a girlfriend? His former brother-in-law. Okay. You're glad you didn't pay for this garbage. So am I. 
<laughs> I'm just sitting here enjoying the freeness of not having had to actually play this game. <laughs> to be fair, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't pay for it either. I've never paid for a copy of Alan Wake. So it's in someone else's copy. Fuck. Very much a monstro. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I forgot. Other fucking couples have siblings. That's right. Okay. Yep. Yep. No, I forgot that, oh, that your spouse his, his can his have wife. siblings. <laughs> oh my fucking god. I forgot that was a thing. Don't mind me. <laughs> Don't mind her. She just has like, you know, fucking baby children. That's right. Your siblings are like, what? My eldest sibling is, how old am I? 20? She is 11. <laughs> She'll babies. be turning 21 before I am. Yeah, you know, I, you know, no, she'll be turning 12 before my, my I turn 21. My sister is turning 36. Well, welcome to being the youngest sibling, Dave. I'm the oldest sibling. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. What happens to people you date? And it's not, I mean, don't be wrong. Like Avery's brother is, he's like 13. Mm -hmm. it's, just, it's so weird. It's so weird. No, you want to know what's weird? What's weird is being 15 years older than your youngest sibling. That's what's weird. Instead of that weird 20 year old sibling that, you know, like kids talk about in like middle school and whatnot, I'm going to be that weird 30 year old sibling. Right? Right. That's more or less the gist of it. I think that the main, like the- Gist? Yeah. Gist. Gist. Yes. I think that the main, I, I feel like the main, like, really cr creepy part was the fact that this guy who had literally never even talked to this girl before told her that he would take care of her kids. And she's 60, and it was just like, yeah, I'm not planning on having yeah, kids, my bruh. That's, uh, that's because he like, wanted to put his penis in her bum hole. Yep. I mean, she is, like, super cute, but, like, she's cute in, like, a childlike way, which is, you know, which makes it even more weird, so... It's just like it's just. Wow, how well fucking wonderful for you to kamikaze, you faggot! <laughs> Fuck you, game! Oh, I'm. Like, it's, we're not even 10 minutes in, and I'm already losing my shit. Well, you gotta stand another. 13 minutes. Yep. The fuck is anything? Yep. No, Caesar Nova says it's just like it's gif. Instead of gif. Um, what? No, it's it's not that simple. It's it's the gist of it. Yeah, the gist of it. Why are you so bad at English? <laughs> Fuck! It's your main language other than Hebrew. Fuck Sad sake. part is I don't even speak Hebrew. You <laughs> should. You're Jewish. <laughs> Fuck, it'll work in Jewish world. Yeah, man. You're gonna be a, if you're going to be a scrape, I don't have a big nose. I'm really bad with money. What more do you want from me? <laughs> well, you're not bad with money. Eh. I just don't spend money on things. That's the whole point of being good with money. Is you don't spend money. Well, but I just don't spend money with on things because I'm lazy. And also spoiled. But that's not the point here. I'm not actually also, Jewish. My name is Hebrew, though, to be fair. It is. Me, no, me and my no, no. baby brother's name is Hebrew, which I will never no, no, understand. Your last name sounds Jewish as well. But it's not. How do you know? Because the only part I know is British and German. On my dad's just, just, side. Here's the, my mom's German, here's, here's the one Germans. Uh, there are people that are Jewish that have hid the fact that they're Jewish. Fuck's sake. You gon' die. Yeah, I did. Because fucking... Dipshit decided to go and go, ah, ah, yeah, I'm a fucking piece of shit. Well, she just coming, baby, because that dick on me now, no, taking me fucking dick off. Oh, this happened at my work, Romad. I wasn't there, though. Otherwise, I would have told the guy to fuck right off. <laughs> oh, I would have. I'm like, buddy, you're Yeah, new. no, see. Get like, the hell away from her. 
I don't care about age differences as long as the person is over 18, even though in Canada, like, legal age of sexual consent is 16. That's, that's only if you're 18 or younger. Is it? Yeah, man. Oh, well, there you if go. You're, if you're over 18, it's still statutory rape. There you go. There you go, you found it where you're supposed to go, Dave. Good yeah, job. I just have to go through a fucking gauntlet. Was not life a gauntlet, Dave? No! Are you sure? Because I'm yes. pretty sure it is. <laughs> also, you're scaring the chat. Oh, by the way. I'm just scaring a little bit, so don't worry about it. Yeah, just a little bit, eh? Yeah, well, he wants to serve you in the film, so it's fine. Okay. Yeah, but anyway, no, she's 16, he's 21. I am never have been okay with that. Like, even as an 18-year-old, I thought that dating someone in grade 9 was iffy. Oh, I would do that. It's too gross. Yeah. How about everyone just fucked right off? And I'm sure certain people in Canada are now immune to that age Yeah, law. this is great. I love this bullshit. I thought for a second yeah. that Dave would lose his hair, put on a hundred pounds, and turn into DSP in the process. No. <laughs> I'm losing my hair and I'm putting on weight, but not that fast. <laughs> Is that why you want your hair to be semi-long, Dave, because you're losing it and you feel the need to cherish it while it's still here? Yeah, exactly. Well, I mean, you could always go bald and just wear really crazy wigs. No, so that means I have to spend money on the wigs, and it also means that I have to put up with the itching, which is terrible by the way. Yeah, but if you really want hair, then, I mean, wigs. I want that. Actually, I, I could pull off being bald, so I don't, I don't, I don't think I can bother. Thank you for fucking right off. I'll wait. It's a demolition derby. A, demolition derby, a death rally. Super entertaining. Super. This game is so boring. Dodge, Dave, dodge. Nope. I can't. They won't let me because they're dicks. Wow. That's wrong with this game. It see, is so right? fucking bright, you can't see where you're aiming. It's so full of guys, you don't know where the hell you're going. Zero, see, I feel you. Because I was actually, I wanted to dye my hair blue a little while back because like I just really like the color blue and honestly dyeing my hair blue would probably like make Fuck my me. eyes pop really mu a lot because they're like this really nice like gray bluish color so like I wanted to dye my hair blue and kind of cut it kind of short and then like SJWs took over the world and I'm like fuck my life and I now I don't want to dye my hair blue <laughs> what the fuck is this a car. what the fuck is this Car trying wow. to <laughs> But I mean, Azura Nova, you could probably still pull off the blue hair and like work on the process of I'm taking back blue hair from SJ SJW. Look at this fucking bullshit! Dave, you didn't dodge. I hate this game. I hate this game. You know what? I'm fucking done. I'm done. I'm I don't think I can handle this game anymore. <laughs> it's dude. <laughs> Do you see any redeeming qualities of this game whatsoever? I didn't see any redeeming qualities first fucking stream, my bro. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, we can be great blue eye buddies. Yeah, you know, blue eyes, white dragons. Yeah. Room. Room. Oh, thanks, dick. Wow! Put the fucking guy out going backwards. When the guy is obviously going to be coming at your face. Or in your face. Or on your face. I, d I just don't know. <laughs> how the living... You know, this is just that much of a statement of how shitty my life must have been in 2012. Because I like that game. That is a sad state of affairs. Blue eyes, white power, the card you never knew existed. <laughs> That's 
So. I've still never felt no. Even even reverse gender, it's no. Honestly, like I said, even at 18, I was not cool with dating anyone in like the ninth grade, and they are what like 14. Yeah. That's only a four-year age difference. Oh, that bothered me too. Like 16, 19, 19, 19, 20, and then one. That's a no, man, like, you gotta be 18, then you can date whoever the fuck you want, what age you are, I don't give a shit. <laughs> if you're not 18 and dealing someone and dating someone older than 18, that's not a good thing. It's not. He's not good. He's not good. Not okay. No! Fishermen have secret fishing spots. I know, my grandpa got mad at me one time because I was yelling really loud because I, I was trying to catch a fish. <laughs> All of you, you so fucking suck. That's the thing though. Me and Dev are Dev years apart. I don't care about age gaps as long as you are older than 18. Once yeah. you hit 18 years of age, you can date whoever the fuck you want. I don't care. But you gotta be older than 18. That's like... Because honestly, once you're around 18, like, you've hit a level of maturity where you're still a stupid idiot, but, like, you're going to make slightly smarter decisions for yourself. Only slightly. Only slightly. slightly. But, like, when you're younger than 18, you're still dealing with, like, weird... <laughs> We're dead years apart. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. I don't even care if I did. That's still funny. It's because devs are reprobate. How about a 50-year-old dating a dating year old? Eight... Wow, I can't talk. I'm talking too that's, fast. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine, man. I don't give a shit. Like, there's a famous actress right now dating, like, a, like she's, like, what? Like, I think 30, 30-ish something, and she's dating someone who's, like, 70 years old or some shit. I don't care. It's like Anna Nicole, Anna Nicole Smith type of thing, so it's, it's fine. You know? Yeah. I don't give a shit as long as you're older than 18. Honestly, I told myself when I'm 20, I don't give a shit. I'm just going to date whoever, whoever, and I'll be happy with whatever age they are. <laughs> no, no, don't, don't worry about it. Yeah. So that's that. Mm. Don't Everyone date just... people if you're younger than 18. <laughs> just don't date. Don't do it. I didn't, so <laughs> and I turned out just fucking horrible. <laughs> oh, you fucking dick! Yeah, this is great. Yeah, this is great. Ooh. This is great. This is fucking great. I knew that was gonna happen. The guy was just gonna come down. Slowest motherfucker that you could probably find in the game. I don't even know how many people I dated when I was younger than 18. How many people? I think only three. Yeah, but you know what? I'm okay with being a sleut. Oh, fair enough. So I went from just being like totally virginal to oh, that's never a good sound, being really Really bad. slutty? Not even a slut, just like trying really hard to get an actual decent girlfriend and failing. Well, that's, the, that's the thing though, like, like people are just like, yeah, you're such a, like, I'm like I'm a huge slut, to be fair. Well, I'm not now, obviously, because I'm dating Deb. There's a difference between But I did it like in a healthy a lot. way. Yeah, there's a difference between trying a lot to find someone that's reasonably worthwhile to date and going through, a, you know, like having all like flings and, and uh, um, like flings and dates and stuff like that. And, you know, just be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna fuck every person in existence. Mm -hmm. That's the thing though, I never really... I can be a huge slut and date dev. <laughs> yeah, I guess I could be, yeah, that's true. I don't know, I just, I honestly, me and a lot of my friends, like a large portion, I slept with a large portion of my friend group, and we're like, well, not all of us are still friends, but we all stayed friends. Like, having sex with each other didn't affect us in any way because, you know, we were just doing the do because we could and it's fun. Like, I didn't, you know, it just involves a lot of sex with Dev. Yeah, well, we're not going to talk about that right now. <laughs> I don't think we're talking about that ever. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, we're almost at that point. I don't know. I, 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 have I ever slept with one of my friends? Besides, I guess, Avery? Well, that's yeah. the thing, though. Like, like, people can sleep with their friends, but in most cases, like, 90% of cases, it just ruins the friendship. 
Yeah, it does. See, that's the thing, though. Like, it never really ruined any of my friendships. So I was just kind of like, yeah, man, like, we did the do, and that you want to do it again sometime, hit me up. probably means you're just emotionally unattached. That's the thing, though. That's what that's what being a slut is all about. Like, you shouldn't get emotionally attached to people who you're sleeping with if you just want to slut around. Wait, does, doesn't that mean that you, you are actually kind of a slut, then? Because I am a slut. I, I keep telling you that I am. <laughs> what the fuck did Dev see in you there? You're such a dick, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> okay. Um. Candy ass jerk. <laughs> <laughs> the truth comes out. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Not gonna throw shade in Naomi anymore. We're in the light now. Alright, well, uh, next time we play this, we won't because I'm fucking done. You gotta finish it, Dave. You're no, the one my game sucks You're so the much. one who wanted to do the DLC. Fucking deal with it. Fine, next time we play this, I'm gonna finish this bitch. Yeah.